town. But I'm, this is not my hat. I'm wearing a hat because it's cold in here. It's flipping freezing. But this is pretty much for yesterday because pretty much as soon as I got in, had some dinner, and then like 30 minutes later, we went out to a couch surfing event and got to meet people and stuff. Should have grabbed some food there, but I didn't. Just the dinner did not fill me up. It was a it was ratatouille. So, but like it was very vegetarian dish, and there was tomatoes, zucchini, cucumbers, and like a bunch of other vegetables that I've like never eaten. So it was good. Just you know, I'm very hungry, but. Losing my voice a little bit. Talked a lot yesterday. I had to defend Guam's honor like nobody's business. Because, you know, like, we have our name and, like, where we're from. And they're like, Guam? And I'm like, yeah. And they're like, it's made up. And I'm like, yeah. And, like, because my phone doesn't work, I can't be like, yeah, it is, motherfucker. So, I had to defend Guam's honor. And it's just like, you know, I've just, like, I've been on my feet for, like, almost six hours at that point. So I was just like, can we sit while we talk? Nope, we stood the whole time. I'm like, fuck. So pretty much what happened yesterday and today was woke up, got my stuff together, got on the couch up in place. Then we just w we walked to where the entrance of the catacombs was because my phone said it was there and I got there and I did like saw no signs or anything for it. So like when I asked my host, I was like, yeah, is it like by a giant lion statue? And he's like, yeah. And I'm like, I did not see shit. God damn it. So I was in the right place. I just did not see it. So, uh, but it didn't really matter because at that point it was closed anyway. Because I had researched it on that day. And I was like, yeah, from 10 to 12. And it's like, damn, I missed it too. So did that. And I was like, you know, I walked from the very... I wasn't even in Paris, I walked from a suburb outside of Paris, but south of it. Walked to the center for the catacombs, couldn't find it. Then I walked left to the Eiffel Tower, yay. And then I started walking north. And I hopped on a back trail to get to here, which is like the tip top north of Paris. Also, it's apparently like the African community here, which is new. Cool. It's been a while since I've seen. Is it from African American or African Europeans? I don't know, but it's cool because like I'll hear them speaking French and I'll hear that Haitian accent just a little bit, just just a little bit. And it's like, oh, it's so cool. This is cool hearing people speak French. But yeah, met some people at the event too. So yeah, it's it's funny because one of them was like, oh, I saw your post on the emergency thing. I was actually just gonna host you. And it's just like, ah. Pretty funny guy. And apparently, this, this goes out to one of my friends who makes all puns all day. He would love France because that is literally French humor. They make puns. They're all like, oh, it's French humor. And I'm just like, oh my god, he would love it here. So I just kept making pun after pun. And they're like, let's tell cheat jokes now. And I'm like, okay. And then one of the French was like, he's like, I only have one, but it's not very good. And I was just like, God damn it. I was like, so fucking funny. Tried Heineken. I just, I don't like Heineken. It's just, ugh. ugh. I like my drinks to be sweet. I don't know if you can hear it the outside, but. That's outside. <sighs> so yeah. Came here, ate, went to that event. And now I am uploading a video from the Apple Tower. And this one. And then. Uh. I don't know what to do today because I was on my feet for like 10 hours yesterday. Yeah, as soon as I got down, I just, as soon as like my legs went up, it was just like whoosh, lightheadedness. And I was like, oh my god. So, I am going to, you know, get ready slowly, put on my shoes. Also, I should note, my shoes are fucked. Look at that. Look at that. Um, hiking boots, my ass. These are the best hiking boots we have. They're very durable. They'll last for a long time. Really? Oh, no. It's already starting. Oh, my God. It's already. Nope. Oh, my God. Okay. It's already starting to crack. 19 days of walking in, I guess, cold weather. 
it's just a big bill. But they're water repellent, so that's cool. Ed proof, apparently. I don't know, because it says so right here. Water proof. So yeah, the shoes are cracking, so I'm just like, ah. Also, what's great is that the day, the day I got rid of, like, you know, my big, big wool hat and my big scarf thing and big, you know, mittens, like, you know, everything heavy, it then gets cold and it's like now, like, negative weather. So I'm just like, as long as I start walking, I warm up pretty fast. Um, so yeah, so we're gonna see if we can maybe go to the cemetery today. That'd be cool because I have some metro tickets so I can, you know, metro it up over there. And I'm supposed to buy ingredients for crepes at the market that's down the street, and I'll have to like use the bag, otherwise, they'll charge me like 10 cents, but whatever, I'll use the bag. So you know, if I do that, then everyone gets crepes, so it's just like, but I'm really fucking hungry, but I'm in Paris, and everything's expensive, so, like, I'm trying to think where I can go to get, like, my fill of, like, food, so to speak, so I'll be researching food, because dinner is not until 8 o'clock, and it's, like, noon now, so, hmm. Also, I got into the show today, which... That's such an interesting show. That was so great. Oh my god, I'm tired of my feet and my legs are just like not happy. But it's nice and cold, so it's just you know that whole cold coffee and stuff is just like not happening. But I wonder if I can do it on this mat. Yeah. So you see this? This is Terry. And I was, it's going to be very convoluted, but, you know, bear with me. Da -da 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 okay. Or nothing. I was at this pink lab, and I pretty much walked to, okay, let's see if I can do this. Yeah. Walked to the center, so, oops, pink lab, center, and then I could tell her, and I walked a little bit more, and then I took my trail to up here. So, you know, we're like, oh, you can walk across Paris in like an hour and a half. And I'm like, you see my backpack. And it's like, also, you know, I'm never in a state of like full recovery because it's like, you know, you rest and you gotta walk again and you rest. But it's never like, oh, I'm, I've been off my feet for five days, so I'm good now. But I got my noodles. Just look at my town that I get to. Back heel, goes down. Back heel, goes down. And that's Paris to Saint Jean de Port. I hope I say that right because I'm slowly picking up words. Like, you know, I know the word for sale is sold, even though it's spelled soldix. And then, you know, the word for hail is mon. So I'm picking up French here and there, very tiny bit. But <sighs> so I didn't go to bed till like 2 a.m. I heard my, I'm so glad I set my alarm at 10, because I heard it, and then I went back to sleep, because I was like, nope, fuck it. And then just outside, hank, 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 and then the ambulance is hank, 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 and I'm like, oh my god, just let them pass! So, but yeah. But Paris is nice, it reminds me of New York. And people seem to get, like, a little, like, about it, I'm just like, dude, this is like the same concept in New York, you know, it's a big melting pot with all these different communities, and it's got all these like little gems. So, you know, just it's just not as tall. You know? It's like the same thing. Also, oh my god, also. While walking to Mon Montier, I think that's how you say it, but like the church on the hill, which is like almost the highest hill in Paris. Everyone was like, you know, street artist people. And you know, my host is like showing me around the area going, and he's like, Yeah, this is where you draw. And he comes up and he starts talking. And I'm like, nope, don't make eye contact, don't look, because he's gonna he's gonna wanna fucking draw you and he's gonna have to pay. And he's like, Yeah, they also speak perfect English. And I'm like, you And then, you know, fucking guy starts drawing and like my host is like, Do you want a portrait? And I'm like, you know, when he's doing this thing, when the arts does this, I was like, No. But then he walks off and he's he's like, I'll be right back and I'm like, No, you mm, like how do I politely decline when he's already started to draw? And like I'm 
bad. It's good, but it's just like, you know. I thought it was fine, black and white. You know, he's like, he's like, oh, I use my art supplies. That's why it cost so much. Eighty dollars. Mark wanted to charge me eighty dollars, and then he's like, student discount is sixty, and I'm just like, glad I'm a student, you know. But it's just like, I was like, I don't have that kind of money. I was like, I was just, I was just like, I was like, nope. And then he's like, he's like, oh, come on, something 30. And he's like, oh, 50. And I was like, I was like, you don't have any money. You know, I literally don't have that money. And then I just I like, found the card. And he's like, oh, ATM machine right there. And I'm like, no. I'm just like, you know, I look at my house. I'm like, what do I do? And he's just like, mm. And I'm just like, mm. So, like, I was, I was like, I have to. I was like, that's what I have. I have to. Ten. So, you know, I was like, I have $10. That's all I have. Ugh. I look better at night. Yeah, so I got this for $10. But, you know, if that's $10 of my money I could have used for food. That's what I'm doing. It's not bad looking. It's not bad at all. His name is Francois. You know, it's like I'm walking. I can't exactly be carrying this around with me, so I am gonna have to either send this back home or throw it away. But I really don't want to throw it away because you know I spent ten fucking dollars on it. Trying to charge me sixty for it. I'm just like, oh. He's like, oh, art supplies. I'm just like, no, I'm an artist too, okay? I know, and I know, I know the scams, okay? Oh, and he's all like, oh, you know, beautiful model, beautiful picture, and I'm just like, mm -hmm. like I'm not. I don't know if the word is vain, but it's just like I'm not that like into my looks. It's like, dude, I've been walking. And, you know, it's like, at that point, like, I had showered that day, but it was, like, nighttime, and I was, like, tired, and my hair was, like, a big mess, and I'm just like, I'm, no, you shut your face. Right? You just sit in there and be all, like, move it. It makes me want to buy it. But, yeah, so. I'm going to have to, like, send this off to the junk dump. <sighs> also, those churches with, like, the gold coins, that stuff is cool, and I'm thinking, like, that might be, like, the best souvenir thing I can have. It's tiny. Yeah, it has a little life lesson, but it's tiny. It's cool, so like we can like get a bunch of that stuff together and just send it off. So we are gonna try to go to the graveyard today. If not, we have to at least go to the market and get ingredients. Wait. Weird. We said do it when we get home. Okay. So be bad, everyone, and you know, bonjour from Paris and au revoir, because I'm gonna die in late January. So, ta ta.